and I am showing you how to count vehicle in uh, in case traffic analyzer. So I select draw a county line and draw a line here and draw a, another line in there and save uh, play and it's counting. So you see here it's moving and the quantity is there and the average speed is there and real time is there. So it's pretty good for traffic counting in software. So uh, how can I collect this code and other things? So let's go. Uh, here, this gentleman, uh, this gentleman, he uploaded this code in there. And uh, there is some uh, thing how to add path and other thing. <clears throat> so first, uh, what I have to do, I download this from here, clone, I download the zip. And later I go there and make a folder, case analyzer in the C, case analyzer. And then uh, select this folder FFM easy and copy the path. And uh, in here, environment variable in my system environment variable, I go there. <clears throat> and uh, environment variable, uh, go there, new, select the path. Uh, say edit and say new and after selecting it, press it in here so case analyzer fm pez and select ok after that uh, so the uh, the author give a video in there you can you can play this video or either you can download a new video so and you will find the uh, running file case traffic analyzer dot jar in here just uh, press ok and it will give you this platform so i take a new video i download this video from internet and uh, uh, open the video in here open it and save to my desktop and i also want to <coughs> just so i open it here and save file to my desktop and i also want save a video file i say on and write the result in csv file and so here um for counting draw a counting line so i click here and here i draw a line in there and draw another line and draw another line here okay then i say play so it's playing and counting the vehicle and also average speed so mainly you see here uh, when i draw the line in here uh, it it measure the distance divided by real time so it gives me the average speed in there and counting object is by OpenCV and javascripts programming so thanks for watching and i will keep the link in the video description